Hi, it's Steve. Today we'd like to show you how to change the door switch assembly on your dryer. It's a really easy repair. Let me show you how we do it. Now before we begin this repair, the first thing we'll need to do is to disconnect power to the dryer. So either pull it far enough forward that you can unplug it, or locate your electrical panel, turn off the appropriate breaker, or remove the appropriate fuses. Once we've done that, we will pull it just slightly forward. We're going to need to raise the main top to access those components, so you either need somebody to hold it in place or have some type of a lanyard to support it. So our next step will be to raise the main top of this dryer so that we can access the component. We pulled it away from the wall a bit. We're going to take a putty knife. We'll go in this gap between the front panel and the main top. And you'll find a clip on top of that front panel. You just line the putty knife up with that. You press that clip. And then lift up on the top to clear it. Do the same for the opposite side. And once we've unclipped that from the front panel, we'll tilt that into a vertical position. Now the hinges are not strong enough to support that top, so unless you have somebody to hold it in place, just fashion up some type of a lanyard. We can attach one of the holes in the bottom of the main top. There's also a hole in the top of the cabinet on the side. Just remove the little rubber bumper. And make sure that's firmly attached with a slight backward bend on that top so that it doesn't fall forward on it. Now you may find it easier to remove one of the screws that secures the front panel to the cabinet. So the one closest to the switch, just simply remove that screw and that'll allow you a little more room to work with that switch and harness assembly. The screw is typically a quarter inch hex head screw. And just allow that front panel to come ahead slightly. We'll disconnect the wire harness retaining clip and just slide that back out of the way. Now the switch is held in place by a bracket that comes through from the outside of the door panel. But you can pop it out of that bracket using a small flat blade screwdriver. Go between the switch and that bracket and just pry it away and you can take the tension off of it. And you can do the same for the bottom half of that switch. Slide the switch out of the bracket, and then we can remove the wires and attach them to the new switch. So I want to take note of the location of each of those wires. And if they're on there snug, you may need to use a pair of needle nose pliers to pull them off. Attach them to the new switch. Now with the switch wired up properly, we're just going to set that aside. We'll open the dryer door and remove the old bracket if it's damaged. If not, you can reuse that one. We'll just slide the new one in through that opening. It's actually helpful when reinstalling the switch in that bracket to leave the dryer door open so that you can hold that bracket in place. So we'll then take that switch just tuck it under one edge of that metal bracket either top or bottom. Line it up so that the button goes through the center of the hole. Press the switch into place. And then make sure the clip captures both edges of that switch. We'll 
take the wire harness retaining clip, fit that back through that opening. Make sure that's secured firmly to the top of the front panel. We can close that door up now. Then we'll replace that screw that we removed from the cabinet to the front panel. that firmly attached, just make sure that the wires are tucked safely in that harness restraint so that it doesn't contact the dryer drum. And now we're ready to put the main top back down. We're now ready to remove our lanyard. Replace the little rubber bumper that we removed. Lower that front panel down into place. Make sure the sides are even. And then snap it down onto those clips. Now we're ready to push the dryer into position. We're now ready to push the dryer back into position, reconnect the power, and your repair is complete.